What's poppin' T-Squad? It's your girl, Keisha, a.k.a. Color Me Pink, and I am here with a fashion killer video. So you all know I have my fashion killer series on this channel where me and my co-host, Sharita, break down the fashions from the major award shows, Red Carpets. But I wanted to bring you guys something different. Fashion is a big part of my life. I love everything about luxury designers, um, regular, you know, stores like Shein, Boohoo, Fash Fashion, all of that type of stuff. Anything related to fashion, I am here for. So I wanted to bring to you all some of my favorite shows from the Spring 2023 Fashion Week shows. I mean, these designers have been showing up and showing out. Today, I wanted to bring to you all the 2023 Spring Summer Christian Siriano show. He's one of my favorites. He always delivers. And the one thing that I really loved about Christian Siriano, who, if you don't know, he won Project Runway years and years ago. He has gone on to be one of the best designers in the game right now. He's dressed so many of your favorite um, actors and actresses. And I love the fact that he is size inclusive. I also loved that in this um, spring show, he showed it at Elizabeth Taylor's former townhouse in Midtown, New York with guests like Janet Jackson. Um, it was just a beautiful, beautiful show. And I also loved the fact that it was a callback to old Hollywood, which is one of my favorite eras of all times. Um, Christian was quoted with saying that he really wanted to channel Elizabeth Taylor and Catherine Hepburn with the tailoring and with the modern takes based on Marilyn Monroe and Bianca Jagger, who were some of my style icons. This show was magnificent. It reminded me a lot of Marlena Dietrich. Um, it was just elegant and it was just high class and just top notch. So let's get into the show. At the end of this video, I will let you all know which were some of my favorite looks. Let's get into the Christian Siriano Spring 2023 runway show.
I got my whole entire life with that show. I wish that I could have physically been there. First of all, just to be in Elizabeth Taylor's home, one of her many homes, I'm sure, would have just been the icing on the cake. But to see these beautiful creations that Christian came up with was just mind blowing. And I really wanted to wear all of the pieces. Let me show you guys some of my favorites from this collection. This black suit, bitch. You come into anybody's funeral with this suit on, you are shutting it down. It is giving wife. It is getting, I'm giving, getting everything. The insurance check just cleared. Yes, ma'am. This suit is fantastic. The wide brim hat just adds a whole different touch of sophistication and class. This was stunning. I love that it was kind of a play on a female tuxedo. I love the white wide lapels, the white like cuffs on the sleeves. It's just so chic and sophisticated. I, I live. This black peplum dress. I don't know if it's a dress or if it's two pieces, but what I particularly love about this look is that so many different body types can wear this look. You can wear it if you're petite, if you're curvy, if you're plus size. And that peplum is, if you have a tummy like me, it's going to conceal the tummy and it's just extra chic and it just looks rich bitch rich as fuck i need to see someone during award season wear this dress this is giving me valentino red vibes it's sexy but not overtly sexy i love the cutouts the gloves somebody needs to wear this somebody this is another dress that i need to see being worn by a young hollywood starlet Give this dress to somebody that's on the up and coming um, in Hollywood. Like this screams young Hollywood to me where it's giving fashion, but it's still young and flirty. I love the sheer fabric, the floral like little appliques or whatever on this. The color is just striking. It's going to be a talk piece as soon as you walk into a room. Everybody's going to be looking at you. This look is just something that once again, it's a wearable look. And that's another thing that I love about Christian's clothes is that they're all wearable. It's not some shit where you looking like, who the fuck gonna wear that? This is so cute. You can wear this on a date, out to brunch, to a show, to a concert. It's easy, it's breezy, it's fashionable, and it's attainable for so many different women. Now this right here, my nigga, <laughs> if... Zendaya 
or somebody tall and skinny don't wear this to the Golden Globes or to the Oscars this year, I'm going to slap everybody. This is a masterpiece, bitch. This is the type of dress you want to win an award in so it can be archived. This is fabulous. Christian dug in his bag on this one. This dress is another one. Like, there's so many different dresses in this collection that can be worn during award season. I can see like a Storm Reed, Haley Steinfeld, Amanda Seyfried, so many different girls in this dress. This is a stunner. The feather crop top, the big billowy ball gown skirt. It's just giving you a classic Cinderella moment. Emma Watson would look good in this as well. Now, if the first black suit was the wife, this outfit right here is the mistress coming to collect her things and let the wife know, bitch, I'm here <laughs> and be pressed. This suit is just, I need it on my body. I need it on my body right now. It is just, oh, <laughs> it makes my nipples hard. I am obsessed with this dress. This dress would make a great look for like a bridal shower if you're getting married or for a reception look after your wedding. This like Grecian toga effect to it. It's off the shoulder. It's beautiful. I can see Gal Gadot in this. Um, I can also see like a Margot Robbie in this or who else could wear this? Hmm. Emmy Ronsom would look great. Jessica Biel would look great in this. And Hathaway would look really good in this look. Even somebody like a Tracy Ellis Ross or Elle Fanning would look really beautiful in this dress. This outfit is such a modern take on old Hollywood. I can see a Greta Garbo or a Marlena Dietrich or, or Olivia de Havilland in this outfit. This is stunning, stunning. You were this bitch to an event. Everybody's going to be on your dick. Please believe. Yes, God. Oh, and last but certainly not least is this ball gown. It's young, it's edgy, it's bright. I love everything about this. I need to see this on somebody young and edgy like a Zoe Kravitz or a Christian Stewart. This has that rock and roll type of feel to it where you need a bad bitch to be in this look. I can see Rachel Bilson in this, Kiki Lane, hell, even Kiki Palmer. This is just fabulous. I'm obsessed with this whole entire collection. Christian did the damn thing. Let me know down below in the comment section. Did you love this collection? What were some of your favorite looks? Do you all want more of these types of videos from me? Because I really want to start bringing you all more fashion content. I do have some try on haul videos coming up for you guys that I cannot wait to show you. Make sure to thumbs up this video, you guys. Like and subscribe and hit that notification bell button. I love you and I'll see you on the next video. Bye.